Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I'll let you know that Microsoft had officially confirmed that this month's Patch Tuesday security update for Windows 10, KB5058379, is displaying a BitLocker recovery screen at startup for some users. And as I mentioned in the video, which will be linked, Microsoft said it is urgently working on a resolution for this issue. Now, just to let you know that if you are affected by this issue, Microsoft has now rolled out an out-of-band update, also known as an emergency update, which is KB5061768. Now, Microsoft is not rolling out this update automatically. So it's not an update you will find through Windows Update on your Windows 10 device. And it should only be installed on your device if you are affected by this issue. Check the video out I posted yesterday for more information if you are. So it's a manual update that needs to be downloaded from the Microsoft Update Catalog. And I'll leave a link to the update catalog for the update in the description for easy access and reference. And Microsoft has this to say in the release notes for the update. Microsoft says it's fixed. A known issue on devices with Intel Trusted Execution Technology, TXT for short, enabled on 10th generation or later Intel vPro processors. On these systems, installing the May 13, 2025 Windows Security Update might cause the Local Security Authority Subsystem Service, LSASS, process to terminate unexpectedly, triggering an automatic repair prompting for the BitLocker recovery key to continue. So that's Microsoft's official confirmation of this fix. So if you have been experiencing this issue after installing KB5058379, as mentioned, this will be linked in the description. And you just choose your version of Windows 10 here to the left. So as an example, Windows 10 64-bit, Windows 10 32-bit. So you get the general idea, Windows 10 ARM 64. And if you don't know how to download and install an update manually from the update catalog, I've posted a video that's helped quite a few uh, folks out. I'll leave that link down below and in the end screen if you want to go check that out in case you are unaware how to download an update from the catalog. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.